What's up, beautiful? How you doing? So, you're looking, whoa, stunning? Wait, let me just move my hair a little out of my face. Oh my God, you're like beautiful. Yeah, you are. So, there's one thing that I've never done to my hair and I have done pretty much everything to my hair, color-wise and cut, uh, pretty much everything, yeah. I've had every color in the rainbow. I even shaved my head. I even dyed it black at one point. It's been a lot, it's been a journey, man. And I decided that, you know, blonde was my thing until I woke up today <laughs> and changed my mind. I'm like one of those people who changes their mind often, you could say. A little bit of like a confusing person. Um, but I decided I wanna do something regrettable today. <laughs> Cause that's how I like to lead my life. You know what? Why not do something stupid and then regret it later? Because you only have one life to live and like, you know what I mean? Is it just me? I don't know, is that bad to live? Is that like a bad thing to live by? I don't know. So today I want to dye my hair two-toned, two tones, two-toned, two tones, whatever. I want to dye one side light pink and the other side a mint green blue because I don't know, that just seems right to me. You know, the more colors, the better I feel like. I don't know if that's just like something that's in my head. I don't know. I don't think I've ever actually had a client ask for two tone. Split color, hair color. It's no good way of saying it. A nobody, I've never done it before on a client. Nobody's ever asked me for it. I've only seen like maybe one person come into the salon and get that done ever in my entire hair existence. So I've done everything. I want something new. I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna regret it tomorrow, but it's fine because you know what, life is short. So if you guys wanna see me watch some girls get their hair split tone, hair colored, mm, still doesn't sound right. And then watch me do my own and see how it comes out and hopefully I don't hate my life after. Okay, then stay tuned, awesome. Oh my God, oh my God, I almost forgot you guys. Just kidding, I didn't forgot. forget because I haven't slept in the past couple months because I've been working on a brand called X Mondo, which is my hair brand. I haven't told you guys what it actually is yet. It has something to do with hair and you'll know soon enough. So if you guys haven't seen the launch video of X Mondo, please go watch it. It's dope, it's cool, I made it, it's awesome. Ah, ooh, yeah. And it, it, it's something that you can all have and use and it's gonna be awesome. And I put my everything into this. So go watch the launch video, follow on Instagram, if you guys want updates as to when it's launching and go to xmondohair.com to sign up for the newsletter. That way you are updated the second it is released because there's only a limited amount of products being released the first launch. So if you guys want to get your hands on it, you have to be one of the first to be on the website, which is March 15th. Cool, okay, let's watch some things and color my hair. <laughs> You guys, I know you're probably gonna come for me and be like, oh my God, like you always tell people not to color their hair at home, but you're coloring your own hair at home. First of all, I'm a hairdresser. I'm allowed to, okay? Second of all, I actually think it's fine. The only thing that I think is okay to do at home to your hair is something like this. When you already have your hair bleached by a professional and you're just adding tone to it, which you can call a toner, a glaze, or a whatever you wanna call it, that is okay to do at home because honestly, you really can't mess it up. Like today, I'm using Overtone, which you guys always ask me if I know I'm in the Overtone ads. Yes, I know I'm in the Overtone ads. I've done an ad with them and they're dope and I love Overtone. Here are my two colors. They are so pretty. So we have this mint color, which I made by mixing one part vibrant green and one part vibrant teal with two parts conditioner. That's how I'm making mint. And then just for the pink, I use rose gold because honestly, Overtone's rose gold is kind of just like a light pink on hair that's already white. Unless you already have like some warmth in your hair, it's usually just gonna make it kind of pink and not goldish pink, if that makes any sense. Let's watch some videos while I get started on my hair. Up first we have Nikki Diaz and she is going from this dark, well actually it's kind of blonde, she's like an ombre moment, to split tone hair color, hair thing, color. I'll never know what it is. Hello my sweet angel babies, it's Nikki with Hi, my girl. warm up. I decided I was gonna dye my hair. I only ever dye my hair different colors when I'm in a relationship or <laughs> when I feel secure in, in some guy or some girl that I'm talking to. Honestly, this is bisexual. Like, I, just, I don't. I'm pumped. We're gonna go to the salon. It's 7.30 well, right now. Well, that's matter -like. Uh Let's get into it. Really strong. Just put a little towel on myself to make sure I don't get it all over my clothes because I, I mean, does it really matter at this point? I've stained everything I own, so. Okay, so she's bleaching her hair. She's doing a little retouch. Okay, wait. And I'm gonna start coloring my hair. And she 
Hold on. Okay, also you guys, just a little pointer. I'm gonna start on my root because I know my ends are pretty like, you know, have been through it. They're gonna process a lot faster and they're gonna take the color in and absorb it. And it's gonna probably turn a little bit darker than the root. So I want to have the ends on less time than the root color. So let's get started. No going back. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh. Oh my god, wait, that's so pretty. Oh my, wait, what? Ah! Wait, I want my whole head this color now. <gasps> Am I making a mistake? This is so hard. I honestly hate coloring my own hair. So I'm just carving out my sections. Work, Brad. Okay, it's been a long time since I've done this myself. I don't know how I'm gonna do the back, but um, it's okay. Let's keep watching this video. Here we go. Her hair definitely <laughs> looks a little damaged. Wow. Yeah, her hair, she already said in the beginning, so I'm not shading her, but like, her hair looks a little damned. J what? Damaged. Not the hairdresser's fault. She probably just colors her hair a lot. Okay, this is so hard. No! <laughs> After hours and hours of bleach, Whoa. this is my perfect white blonde canvas that was ready for color. Yes, it looks so beautiful! Oh my god, she's doing like the same moment as me. Girl, yes. She's doing like sort of what I'm doing. Actually, well, I'm doing pink, but she's doing periwinkle. Oh my God, I love that. Also, I'm obsessed with this color. <gasps> this is so satisfying. Watching color go onto blonde hair is like, <sighs> you know, like really bright colors on blonde hair is just like so satisfying. Oh my God, we're like kind of twinsies. Kind of fun. Oh my God. Yes. Wait, she looks so good. Oh my god, me too. Honestly, like truthfully, it is. She's so pretty. It but looks thing, I could not be more amazing on her. Dye your hair whatever the f color that you want to. Oh my god, I am. Thank you. Think Never. What? Who are people? Shit. So many people have already said to me like, oh, is that temporary? Like, do you uh, like that? Whatever. Me. It's like, bitch, I love it. This is me like the first I day you. that I so color it, and then I love. hate my life. <laughs> Oh my god, she looks so good. Nikki, please keep your hair that color. I look psychotic, but like, honestly, what else is new? Okay, now we have Sophia Hanna, and this video has mad views. <laughs> I'm surprised I've never seen it before. Okay, let's see. Sophia, what are we doing today? What? Oh, she's doing blue and turquoise. Dope. Previously oh. filmed me dyeing my roots. That's yellow. Let's see the other side, guys. <gasps> That's too bright. That's now, too bright. It is too bright. Sorry, this is so hard doing my hair and reacting to shit at the same time. That's like neon. Do I care? I mean, it looks cool. It's just like neon, you know? Do I want neon? I keep going and I'm like, do I want this? <laughs> Apparently I do. Apparently like my hand wants it, but like, I don't know if I want it. I'm gonna wet my hair a little bit. Okay, I decided, yeah, it's a good idea. <laughs> it's good for me, okay. I'm gonna do split hair. I've seen a couple of pictures of people yes. split hair. It looks really, really cool. So I do it. Why not? So the two colors I'm going to be using are blue jade and blue velvet. So Ooh, I, I love that. Literally oh. split down the middle. You guys, this is so pink. Way, so dye it and hope the best. See? So it's still a little bit brassy. <laughs> They're like pretty yellow. I would have definitely lifted that a bit more to get like a really pure blonde before I go and do the whole damn thing. This is gonna give you more of like a pure tone. The blue and the yellow of her hair right now are gonna mix together and probably create more of a, a minty turquoise. What? A minty, what am I saying? I'm really not good at talking and doing this at the same time. Oh, oh, oh! I just went the wrong color. <laughs> oh my God, right when I said, I'm not good at talking and doing this at the same time, I color the wrong side pink. No, I want it to be perfect. Oh, no, please get out of my hair. Please get out of my hair. Um, we'll pretend that didn't happen, I guess. Wait, I'm really sad about this. I'm gonna go try and wash it. <laughs> okay, I think I fixed my hair. You can still definitely see a little bit of pink in there. Ugh! But hopefully the blue will cover it and it'll be fine, okay? We're just gonna pretend it's okay and that I'm not mad about it. Yeah. Kind of how I like to live my life. Let's keep watching. She's splitting the hair. Awesome. We love a girl that knows how to split her hair. Too bad I can't really split my hair down the back because it's like short as hell. So that's gonna be a task. So I'm gonna go to the Wait, but her ends are already colored. How's this gonna work? It's better to apply on damp hair 
because when your platinum blonde, your hair is super, super porous. So the color is gonna really take and it's gonna take darker probably than expected if your hair isn't damp because the water is serving as kind of a barrier so that it doesn't take too, too much on your hair. Okay, so now I have one fourth of my hair done. Let's keep applying on the other side. I'm kind of freaking out because it's so pink. <laughs> not gonna lie to you guys, it's definitely not rose gold. I guess I have half whatever. Wow, okay, freaking out a little bit. Let's keep watching. Me too. <laughs> oh yeah, she's going dark, man. She is really going for it. I mean, yes, girl, get that blue moment. Oh my God, give it to me. This looks so much easier with long hair because you can actually section the back. My damn hair won't section. Well, I look actually psychotic. Oh, whoa, that, see, whoa. That's like a midnight blue, honey. Yes, this looks awesome. <laughs> Just caught a glimpse of myself in the monitor. Okay, see, now I get it. Okay, that's definitely gonna work nicely. Oh, oh my God, I keep on getting the blue on the other side. Stop having ADD and like doing both at once. It's so pretty. So oh, I'm so happy for her. I've just quickly blow dried it, so it's oh. a little bit damp. Okay, see, it. what I thought would happen, happened. See, her roots are green and her ends are blue. That's because her roots were yellow and not bleached enough before coloring blue. Ooh. Yeah, I'm pretty pleased how it's just- I'm kind of sad about bad. this. It doesn't look as good as I thought it was gonna look. Burned just about there. That just needs touching up. Here. My hair looks crazy. But the color, the other side, is perfect. <laughs> perfect, I don't know, but yeah, so quite put it there. Blends in quite nicely as I blend the bleach down. Okay, this would look great if it came out right. <laughs> she definitely should have done darker colors, maybe mixed it with like a little bit of black to make it like a dark, dark blue, and it would have gone over that yellow color, but uh, it didn't quite, didn't quite do it for me. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna go finish my hair off camera and then I'm gonna come back and give you my full attention for this last video. I'll be right back. Okay, so update. I kind of feel really cool right now. I'm not gonna lie. And I'm very excited to see what this looks like. Also horrified. Take a look at the back. I did a pretty good job at making it even, I think. Okay, let's watch the last video and then I will rinse my hair off and show you guys a, um, a, a good result. Why did I do this? Okay, and now we have Victoria Loops. She says, dyeing my hair pink and purple. Oh. Why am I doing this? I don't know. I've never dyed my hair on my own before. Well, that's I good. Colors and stuff. Go, your hair that's looks a little dry. I went pink at the <laughs> It's like, give me uh, water. water. Uh, that's what her that's hair is saying. Like, never doing my hair again. But what am I doing it now? Doing it on your own. At least you're not bleaching it on your own. Literally, I look like a popsicle or like an ice cream. I actually really do like those. They're very bright. I know I said I was like nervous, but I feel like I get way less nervous than a normal person doing my own hair because like I've literally done everything to my hair and honestly it's just hair color so right now i'm like looking at myself why did i do this but also who cares i'm just gonna pour both of them out like ah the i'm excited one. for her i'm gonna make some conditioner with the pink one because i feel like that one is real bright no go full on bright so that's what i'm doing and i was like do it do it and i was like you guys just want to see me fail yeah so, we do so here's what we're rocking with right now oh I'm yes so yeah, she's she's going in and uh, I love the technique. She's honestly doing very, very small sections and being very precise with her work. I'm very impressed. Yes, and this pink color is so good for her. I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. And with her skin tone, it is looking this was the hard part. Getting the back in the mirror is like super difficult. Um, She is muted though, because I think her music is copywritten, but I don't want to risk it because, oh my God, they're flagging everything on YouTube now. If there's any kind of music that's copywritten, they will get you. Okay, so she is going in now with the purple and these two colors together are magical. Yo, this looks dope, man. Uh, yeah, these two colors together on her skin tone is amazing. Oh, and she's almost done. Oh, I can't wait to get this washed out and see what it looks like when she's all done. 
Why do I get so excited over these things? Okay, so she's processing it and she's gonna rinse it off and blow dry it. And now I'm gonna see what happened. <gasps> oh my God. I love it. I see like the top has a few pieces, not color for some reason, but you know, we'll let that slip. Oh, she looks so good. I love it. I wish I could tell you guys what she's saying, but her music is copywritten. <laughs> I love that. She likes it. She told me. <laughs> I listened to her video and she said she loves it. This is so artsy and cool and I hope that I can achieve something like that with my hair. Victoria, yes. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna wait like 15 more minutes to rinse out my hair and then I'll be back to show you guys the final results. I really hope I love it and I really hope it's not that dark. <laughs> Are you guys ready for this? I will say one thing, I've never felt like I look more hardcore <laughs> and cool in my entire life. Are you ready? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> like, honestly, I really, really love it. What do you guys think? Let me know. It's definitely a big change. Um, See, this is like the kind of hair that I love when I'm like not in public all the time because I don't really love getting stared at 24 seven. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> Also, the funny thing about this is that I'm moving into this like new building that has like no like young people in it, I'm pretty sure. And like I'm moving there in two days and everybody's gonna think I'm crazy. But that's fine, I don't care. It's cause, cause I am crazy. I love it, I really do. This is the craziest color I've ever done and um, I'm really happy about it. Very even for the most part. Hopefully the back looks good. Came out very nice. I'm very happy with it. And my ends didn't pick up darker than the roots, thank God. I was really worried about that because I hate having colorful hair and it not being like perfectly even. It drives me kind of crazy, but that kind of comes with the territory when you're dyeing platinum blonde hair. Some parts are dry, some parts are not, and it just picks up differently. So you can't really ever get that that perfect. But this looks pretty good to me. I can go like this, I can go like this. I have two-toned hair. <laughs> I'm gonna go stare at myself for an hour. And thank you guys so much for watching today. Follow me on Instagram. Follow X Mondo Hair on Instagram. Uh, get ready for the release of X Mondo Hair. Oh my God. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life. And I will see you all next time. Peace. Oh, I'm so excited about my new hair. Okay, bye. <laughs>